Hey guys, welcome to this video. Today we are going to learn how to limit the input characters that an input can accept. So we will learn how to limit from min characters, okay, and also for max characters. So how can we do this? First, we need to create a form, okay, because all of our inputs needs to be inside a form, okay? And here we can start creating our inputs. So like this, input type text. This is a text input that we put text in it. You can put a name like name, okay? Or first name, like we are trying to ask for a username, okay? And how can we put a minimum digits validation? We just need to use the attribute min length, okay? And here we can put how many digits we want, like five. So who is filling the form needs to put at least five digits here, okay? We can also put an input type submit to send the form and see the validation of HTML in this attribute. So I will put a text like send, okay? And let's open this file on browser. As you can see here, we have our formula. You can put an h1 limit input characters just to get a better visualization. Okay. And if you fill with something like this and try to send, we will receive a validation of input length that we need to fill at least five digits like this. And now we can send the formula. Also, we can put a required here. Don't send the input without values like this. Now we can't send the input blank. We need to fill with something. And also we need to fill with at least five digits. Okay, guys. And how can we do the max length validation? We can create another input. We can do a text area maybe. Okay and put the name of bill, like we are writing something about the user. And now we can add the attribute max length of 20. So let's fill this input with some digits. And now I will put more than 20 digits here. We can make this area bigger, okay. And as you can see, I can't put more then 20 digits. The HTML is limiting me, okay? We will not receive a validation. We can't put more digits. So we can send here because this input hasn't a minimum validation, a minimum digit validation. We also can use the two validations together like this. Mean length 10 digits, mean length 10 digits, and max length 20 digits. So now we need to put at least 10 digits, 10 characters, okay? So we can send the form. These attributes uh, we use to validate something in the inputs, like this, we are requiring some value. And with min length and max length, we are requiring a minimum characters and a maximum amount of characters. Okay, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next one.